Hello everybody, welcome to Daily Entomologist. Um, out here gonna pick up the pitfall traps. Alright, so as you can tell, it's windy as all hell, yet again, out here in the grasslands. But I did take a preliminary uh, walk around, and all the pitfall traps are still there. Um, I did not see what the traps actually look like, so bear with the wind. Oh, well, that was not what I was expecting. There's none of the preservative left. Um, interesting. But as you can see, there is stuff in there. And hopefully it should be preserved enough. But, uh, yeah, that's, uh, But I'll get these situated and then we'll get it on to see what's in the next trap. All right, so we're on the last trap. So we're gonna see what's in here. And all the traps today have had stuff in them. But because it's so freaking windy, I didn't want to film every single one. So. Come on. There we go. So not a lot of beetles. We did get two tiger beetles in here though. Uh, I've noticed a couple other tiger beetles in some other traps as well. So that's kind of nice. Um, we actually did some, did some pretty cool stuff I think. And once I uh, wash them all off and get them all situated, I'll, of course, uh, show you and all that stuff. But, uh, yeah. Uh, so these, uh, the, this was the catch for uh, uh, the month of April. So now uh, I won't to pick them up again until the end of May. So, yeah. Get this up and uh, get the reset and we'll be on our way. Alright, so from the first part of the video out there uh, getting the uh, pitfall traps to now, a month has passed and I apologize with the no videos, but it was migration season for birds so I was out doing some hardcore birding. Uh, I got a lot of good stuff this year too. So now that the bird migration is done, I'm transitioning now back to more insects and continuing work on my stuff and everything. Um, so I got everything off uh, the uh, spreading boards. As you can see, it turned out pretty, pretty, pretty good. So I'm just having them here temporarily. Um, some more stuff, Southeast Colorado. I actually, oh, um, and then the rest of the stuff off the drain boards in here as well. Beautiful blues right there. Got a Pixie from Brownsville. 
intro swallowtail, some blues, some more awesome stuff there. And I actually, I actually haven't pointed the ants I collected from that southeastern Colorado trip. And I still need to point the small stuff from the pitfall traps. Um, unfortunately, the other day, this lamp right here, I bumped it and, uh, and the top fell down and broke my giant swallowtail specimen from Florida. But luckily, the only damage was the wings. Two wings on broken off. So, I'm going to be gluing these back on and they'll be good as new. Kind of really sucks to happen, but shit happens. So, I got to fix that. Um, I'm about to really clean out my room, get rid of a bunch of stuff, downsize a bunch of stuff to make room for all this stuff and clean it up a bit. I actually have another uh, <clears throat> thing of pitfall traps that I picked up the other day for the month of May because that last video of pitfall or the pitfall traps I did last were April so I got the May pitfall traps ready to go and that's going to be in the next video and the next video is going to be some collecting as well because I'm finally going to get out and really go hard on the collecting this weekend for myself and for other people I'm collecting for. So I got that going on. Um, so the stuff right now, I just got out of the freezer just a little bit ago, so they're all defrosting out. This is uh, my uh, the Pawnee when I went and picked up the pitfall traps for the April, so beginning of May, or May 1st or April, through. yeah, that trip. Um, and all these ones were caught here in my neighborhood. Got some bees, grasshoppers, uh, wasps, and uh, tiger beetles, and a little bit ant there. So these are all getting pinned today. Um, I don't know if I'm going to start pointing as well. I might as well. Uh, but yeah. So it took me over a month to make this short video, but that's how it goes sometimes. And as I said, now that the bird migration's over. I can get back into the swing of things for the channel and pick up doing some collecting videos and all that fun stuff again. So uh, thanks for watching. Uh, stay tuned for the next one. Be posted here hopefully in a few days. And uh, keep on bugging.